Manila, the BRP Jose Rizal, FF-150, the first missile frigate of the Philippine Navy, PN, did not encounter any derangement of its various systems during the two-week Rim of the Pacific Rimpact naval exercises held off the waters of Hawaii. Before we begin please like, share and subscribe to my channel, thank you. Manila, the BRP Jose Rizal, FF-150, the first missile frigate of the Philippine Navy, PN, did not encounter any derangement of its various systems during the two-week Rim of the Pacific Rimpact naval exercises held off the waters of Hawaii. No reported safety and security incidents. No weapons, communications, electronics and info SYS PEM, hull, machinery, and electrical SYS PEM, derangements were reported PN Chief Vice Admiral Giovanni Carlo Bacordo said on Monday when asked for updates on the RIMPAC participation of the BRP Jose Rizal. Bacordo said the ship and her crew on Monday, Hawaii time, has just completed their participation in the so-called, War at Sea Exercise, WASEX, and will be entering Jose Base Pearl Harbor, Hawaii on September 1st. This year's RIMPAC exercises were held from August 17 to 31 with WASEX phase serving as BRP Jose Rizal's last serial for the biennial naval exercise. FF-150 completing all given serials of the exercise demonstrates her capability to handle various operational requirements, Bacordo added. During the naval games, Bacordo said BRP Jose Rizal did not fire any missiles because the PN did not participate in the sinking exercise, SINKEX. FF-150 was refueling at Joint Base Pearl Harbor at this time, he said. Bacordo said BRP Jose Rizal's participation in RIMPAC 2020 highlights the competence and capability of the ship and its crew to undertake various maritime operational scenarios, may it be multinational operations with other partner nations, maritime security of commercial shipping, or operating on its own or with its onboard helicopter against surface and subsurface adversaries. The ship is the first PN vessel capable of conducting anti-air warfare, anti-surface warfare, anti-submarine warfare, and electronic warfare operations. FF-150 took advantage of RIMPAC 2020 to train as a team, put the ship at pace with possible real-world scenarios, and the crew to gel during this time, he said. Bacordo said the ship's participation was also recognized by its U.S. counterparts, specifically U.S. Navy 3rd Fleet Commander, Vice Admiral Scott D. Khan, who earlier said they are happy to have the Philippines participating in RIMPAC with BRP Jose Rizal. The ship left Subic Bay, Zambles on July 29, made a fueling stop on Guam on August 2, arrived in Pearl Harbor, Hawaii on August 15 in time for the RIMPAC exercises. PNA See you in the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to my channel, thank you.